How was your previous week with holidays? Just regular break from routine? Short or long travel? Looking at extreme hot weather predictions or surprise flooding in certain parts of the country? Or simply organized your closets and finished the long do laundry? I am sure that break gave you some relaxation and charged your internal batteries. Did you wish you smiled or laughed more during this week? Now you have one more option rather than tickling or pinching your partner or friend. Welcome to Humor from News. A social media feed where you can watch news with a twist of satire. Daily feed in social media, weekly videos in other video websites. Smile, laugh and spread the humor. Like oxygen in the air, most of the content are free. Is it just watching or hearing funny news? No, I do add a content on word for the week, or, funny joke of the week. So you can pretend that you learned something new this week. Like everyone, you may not remember the word after few days. Election is coming, so does social media war. There is enough content for cartoonists, endless sources. Quote for this week. The mental health crisis among young people is an emergency and social media has emerged as an important contributor. That's from U.S. Surgeon General. That's for the social media addicts. We are not that way, isn't. Don't look at the screen time counter in the phone. Word of the week. Perdurable, P, E, R, D, U, R, A, B, L, E. What is the meaning? Enduring continuously, imperishable. What is in your mind after learning this word? Elections and the politician's lies. You are not at fault and you can't change that easily too. What's new this week? $10 million just into 100 years Caesar salad jokes, humor from news. $10 million performer. Paper checks at Target. Justin Timberlake's bar. Pastor's flight upgrade. Fake olive oil. Caesar salad. And more and more. Let us start this week's highlights. Justin Timberlake to open Scottish sports bar after DWI arrest. Here comes his own song lyrics he must have some supernatural power. Everybody says, say something. Say something, say something. Do you believe in mystical powers and blessings? Here is one for you this week. Woman wins $5 million jackpot shortly after finishing breast cancer treatment. Universe has plans for everyone. It's a question of time and patience. In this case being a patient. Changing subject to our favorite airline news. United plane loses tire during takeoff at Los Angeles International Airport. Now I know why the hostess crew asked to open the window shades during takeoff and landing. It's is better to know what is leaving behind the takeoff time. You just don't want to hear it is the tire and lose your sanity all during the flight. On the same airline story front, let us move to the boarding gate scenarios. A pastor is facing federal charges for allegedly assaulting his wife after she got upgraded and he didn't. His next week's sermon at the church will be on how to handle any difficult situation especially if you are with your spouse. Let us talk about the much anticipated costliest wedding for this century. July 12, India's most anticipated wedding of the year Ambani Mega Wedding. $10 million for Justin Bieber's performance fees. My thinking goes, whether I should try my lottery buying passion again. 
something you never know on the salad side. Caesar salad is celebrating its 100th anniversary after being invented in Mexico in 1924. First, I thought it was named after a historic Roman emperor. In reality the salad was named after Caesar Cardinai, an Italian immigrant restaurateur. Second, Mexico is the original place. Related to Caesar salad, who it contains oil-wise? You know the answer. Italian authorities confiscate almost $1 million in fake olive oil. So what was going inside my salad all these years? Next time, you may carry your own oil. On the same salad business but make sure you decide the side dish. Silkworm Sauté Singapore approves insects as food. So if you see something moving in your food, it is the food you ordered in the first place. Target will stop accepting personal checks from customers starting July 15th the latest retailer to stop taking the increasingly rare form of payment. One more last pleasure to go away. Shopper patiently opening the purse, taking the glasses out and finding the checkbook. Then fill in the check details and tear the sheet carefully. An influencer would have made 50 shorts by that time in the social media. Nearly all AT&T cell customers call and text records exposed in a massive breach. Besides myself, now the hacker knows how many unwanted marketing spam calls I am getting every day. Till you get that next marketing scam call, breathe, and relax your day. Thanks for your time see you next week.